institute's falling apart because these jerks are attacking us again. Oh, you're such a crybaby. <laughs> no, no. Look at the bright side. The victims are having even more any fun. <laughs> like that one down there. Exactly. Sucks to be you! <laughs> Me? No, no, the victim. Oh. Why do they have to mess with my institute? Mine's already half destroyed. Oh. <laughs> what? You want the free cookie, yes? Well, that's too bad. Because we're out of cookies! Only good victims get the free cookie. And you're a bad victim. Why? Well, first of all, you're still alive! 
nothing is for free in this world, even if it is labeled so. Besides, we're out of cookies! You know, I hate people who can't accept no for an answer. Or, uh, out of cookies, in this case. Okay, what's this about now, Pride? Do you feel humiliated by the free cookies vending machine? Are you afraid that by not getting a free cookie, the value of your existence is threatened? Or do you simply need somebody to talk to? Is that it? Whatever the case may be, we're still out of cookies! And now get out of my face! Seriously, you're still not giving up. Do you even realize that by now the cookie wouldn't be free anymore because you're spending so much time trying to get one? The label on this vending machine clearly reads free cookies and not get a free cookie if you try hard enough. Alright, I've tried reasoning with you, but you leave me no choice. Seriously, can't we do anything to fight back? You mean, other than sending thousands of creatures to defend us on the surface? Yeah, my calculator says we're clearly outnumbered. Well, I'm sending my chosen victor up there too, but it's so much work to revive and feed it afterwards. Yeah, you lazy bastard. Hey, you don't even have a chosen victim. Yeah, it got killed by the other victim, remember? Crushed into a million pieces with this stupid sword. I told you the sword was a bad idea. Hmm. Oh yeah, now that you mention it. Anyway, back to work. Yep. Your opinion counts. Express how you feel about the latest traps by participating in our ad.
Welcome to the morality intersection. Take the easy way and you will hear a dozen of your friends die in agony. Or choose the hard way and spare their lives. For a while. Make your decision now. Thank you for killing your friends. They are now going to be stabbed in their backs. Enjoy. Death. Some people say it's a handicap. We say it's a feature. Die now and join the terrific community of people who are already dead. It's an understatement to say that you're missing out by not dying immediately. Meet your makers today.
look at this mess. What mess? What mess? Like right here? This trap is ruined. Oh, you mean this is not what it normally looks like? No! Hey, that's the victim again. Oh, hey. Is the microphone on? No, of course not. I rarely use it. I wonder if it even works. Hmm. Whose victim is that anyway? Oh, I don't know. It's chip doesn't respond. Huh. Where are all the other victims? I sold all of them on the black market. I needed the money from your press. Right. And when's the next delivery? I cancelled all contracts. What? Why? I needed the money, damn it! And now stop asking questions! <sighs> okay, okay. Coffee? Yes! Very, very So, you managed to beat your way through Ladder climbing. Our scientists have outlined themselves once again and implemented the ability to climb ladders into your brains. When climbing extremely high ladders, looking down may even induce our famous product dizziness. Two free items for the price of one. If this doesn't sound like a no-brainer to you, we probably forgot to put one in your head.
our scientists have outdone themselves once again and implemented the ability to climb ladders into your brain.
We love to eat rare steaks. We love to eat rare steaks. We love to eat rare steaks.